A new study shows stem cell therapy could reduce the risk of heart attack and stroke in some patients with chronic heart failure. The CDC says more than 6 million Americans have heart failure. That's when your heart doesn't pump enough blood for your body's needs. And most of the time, it's caused by another medical condition like high blood pressure, inflammation. Well, now researchers say stem cell therapy can treat the inflammation that leads to that heart failure. Let's bring in board certified cardiologist and News Nation medical contributor, Dr. Dave Montgomery. Good morning, sir. Good morning, Marky. So, if you could first explain, you know, exactly what are stem cells and why have we been hearing so much about them here lately? Yeah, believe it or not, Marky, we've been in the scientific community looking at whether or not stem cells can be used to regenerate and rejuvenate organs for a very long time, decades. This particular study is encouraging because it looked at directly injecting stem cells that came from living individuals' bone marrow. So no controversy about the origin of the stem cells to see if it can help the heart regenerate. Uh, it's, this is so fascinating. My other question uh, for you, researchers say the new study shows a single shot of stem cells can reduce the risk of heart attack or stroke by 58%. I mean, what does this mean for the more than 6 million Americans living with chronic heart failure? Yeah, I mean, the, the 30,000 foot view question is, can we restore the function of hearts that are failing, right? That are not pumping properly for any number of reasons. And what they did was they took about 500 people and directly injected these stem cells, as we said, directly into the heart and then followed them for up to a year. And what they showed was, although the heart failure outcomes that we really look at in these uh, very sort of complex trials, they didn't meet those, it did show that the heart could contract a little bit better. But the surprising part, uh, Marky, that you uh, highlighted was that it also decreased the risk of stroke as well as heart attack. Well, you say, how can you inject into the heart and decrease the risk of stroke. And this is where the inflammation came in. They showed that the, the stem cell somehow reduced inflammation all throughout the body. And as we know, inflammation is one of the causes of heart attack and stroke. Yeah, and leads to so many other ailments in the body. Dr. David Montgomery, thank you for stopping by. We could chat about this all day long. Want to have you back soon. Sure could. Great to be with you, Marky. See you soon. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.